Alliance Wars can be expensive, but they don't have to be. And that's why I'm here, to give you some proper tips on how to leech from your alliance when it comes to Alliance Wars. First off, don't let anybody pressure you into joining Alliance Wars when you're not ready. Tell them to shut up. Here's a super tip. If you use a third-party chat service, you could use more offensive language. <laughs> also, you want to make sure that you've collected all of your free crystals. I mean, they're free. Alliance Wars could cost you units and take time. Free crystals are just free. And that's a banana value if I've ever seen one. Mm hmm Keep a watchful eye on the Alliance War timer. Whatever you do, don't join until there's less than one hour remaining. I mean, think about it. There's 24 hours in an Alliance War, and there's 30 members in your Alliance. Somebody has to go last. That's just math. Okay, this part is very important. You want to make sure to not include your most powerful champions, as they could end up getting locked in there, and you might need them for your quest. Nope, put that utility champion down. You may need that champion for a quest also. No, you might want to test that champion. You better not include him either. Yep, keep going. Oh, you know what? Yeah, you probably want some kind of immunity champion. You better keep looking through your roster to see who else you have available. Stop! Stop! We found the perfect champions. Iron Man, Colossus, and... Groot! Two champions out of the three have bleed immunity. That's perfect. Now you're ready to join the Alliance War. Now that we've joined the battle group, there's only one thing left to do before choosing our path. We have to take a quick look around just to ensure that somebody else has slain the final boss. Perfect. Now we're ready to move out. Selecting a path can be difficult. What I recommend doing is looking for any of these dots on the screen that don't have any enemies on them. These are what are known as blank nodes. These should give the least amount of trouble and also make you look like a hero to your alliance. Perfect! You've done it! 100% clear! Leeching can be difficult, but you always want to take a moment to congratulate your team on a job well done. However, taking a look at the participants, there are some players that just don't make the cut. Report them to your alliance leader immediately. Now that you've put in all the hard work, it's time for the best part, claiming the rewards. And I know, at first glance, these rewards look like they may not be worth the effort. But trust me, if you've been leeching for as long as I have, you'll start to see the benefit. Now go. Go into the world and leech from your alliance. Let me know what you need help leeching with next. Take care.